Hi learners, welcome to my channel Data Science University with MLV Prasad. The agenda for today's video is Project 2, Panda Street Code, Question Easy, Question Type Easy, Number 1435, Create Session Bar Chart. The GitHub link for the solution is provided in the description below. Let us see the question. just a minute yes okay they have given some session let us assume you are playing some game okay in the first session you played for some uh, 30 something uh, units let us say seconds or something similarly let us assume it is seconds only in the second session you worked for 199 seconds so on so on okay now what they want to do you want to know how long a user visits your application you decided to create bins okay similarly and after that representing the number of things which are there in that we want to represent it okay let me come here Now let us assume um, one minute is equal to 60 seconds. Now they are going to categorize into this bin is 0 to 5 minutes means what? 0 to 300 seconds. Then they want to categorize this one. You can see this symbol. It means 300 is not there. So from 300 to exclude this one. Similarly, 5 minutes means 300 seconds to excluding the 10 minutes 600 seconds similarly third range 600 seconds to 900 seconds and everything else is some 900 to some upper limit whatever it is okay let us see this one 30 falls in this category so it will be 0 5 199 falls in the same category 0 5 okay similarly mm, 299 299 also falls in the same category 05 580 means second category 5 to 10 and similarly 1000 means greater than 900 so this will be following 15 or 4 okay we have categorized it after that you can clearly see this is there three times this is there one time this is there one time that is what we have got it here okay is it clear everyone so what we need to do we need to categorize it so for that we have a inbuilt function called pd dot cut okay let me show you how it is done let us say written written pd dot cut for which one this session stable duration column okay how i want to count let us say in the bins of 0 to 300 which is 5 minutes next up to 600 10 minutes next up to 15 minutes 900 and anything over that okay let us take some upper limit anything to cover everything let me take some big number I'm just taking big number because anything above 900 to anything as I can't keep any infinity kind of these things I'm keeping just some big number where everything will be falling in this region okay now let us categorize it label what is the label if it is falling in the first range they should be called this label If it is falling in the second region, this should be called this second label. If else, it should be third label. Otherwise, this fourth label. Okay. Let us see the output. I think it is labels. Okay, 
you need to return a pandas data frame and you're returning a series okay maybe let me do it like this Mm. or let me do one thing it is what it is just categorizing in these two these things right okay let me do one thing as i want anyway count of rows i can do count of rows so what i did i categorized them and each one how many times it is repeating i'm getting the value counts again it is ready so let me reset index now it will work that's it we can clearly see it is there now what is the issue A three one 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 zero zero any sorting they ask no sorting i think only column names we should change rename columns is equal to hold one duration new one should be called bin old column name count new column name total now let me submit for all the test cases that's it we have successfully solved the problem if you want the code output for this it will be available in this github repository where a list of table is provided for all the details you can get it from the description of the video if you're further interested in learning data analytics, ML, DL, NLP, and generative AI stuff, please fill in this Google form, which is be available in the description. I'll be reaching out to you soon. And if you're preparing for data science interviews, do check out my playlist. It will be greatly helping your interview process. And if you have any other further questions regarding the problem which you have solved, please use this com please use this hashtag in the comment section, and I'll be answering all your doubts. And until then, keep learning guys.